Hey there, all you gamers and game hymns who decided to tune in this video. It's your boy Gweeman, and I'm back for another episode of Rockboy. Um, sorry for there being no upload for Friday and Saturday. Um, on Friday I had a friend staying over, and on Saturday, um, I just didn't have the time. And there's also no recommendation, so sorry about that. Um, promise to try and get, um, maybe two extra videos out this week as opposed to my normal amount of videos. Um, and, so yeah, this is Ruckoy. Might as well talk about Ruckoy. <laughs> uh, um, I think I'm speak. I think I figured out the problem with my audio and why it's sounding so awful because I'm not speaking loud enough. But if I just speak loud enough, then everything should just turn out okay. Um, like right now, actually, I'm speaking louder, and considering that the microphone is literally right next to my face, I don't really think there's much of an issue with where, I, with how I'm, with what's going on, because I don't really need soundproofing to make an okay sounding video, I just need to talk a little bit louder, considering that the microphone is literally right next to my face. Um, well... Let's just continue making this video, I guess. Um, in this video, I'm hoping that we can possibly continue going through this, maybe get up to the levels where we can start killing pharaohs. I know that's been our goal for a couple of episodes, but eh. These things take time sometimes. And I'm happy to do it, because it's just fun for me. Kill the mummy, kill the mummy, kill the mummy, kill the mummy. Alright, that's good. And that's good. Pick up the silver wool. Pick up the silver bag because it's worth lots of monies. So let's go downstairs. Let's see. I'll kill this pharaoh. These guys do a good amount of damage, unfortunately. But, since my defense is so high, I can deal with these guys, no problem. Oh, and I advanced to magic level 34. Good for me. And I'm already starting on my next level on in that stat. <laughs> I guess one gets I have fat stats. Hey! <laughs> now would be the best time to be able to actually be able to record audio on my phone because I actually have a soundboard for I actually have a soundboard for that and it's just sad that I can't play that during videos. Kill the pharaohs, kill the pharaohs, kill the pharaohs. Come on, one more shot, one more shot. Perfect. Let's see. Anything I can equip? Correction, anything better I can equip? Nope. I suppose I could always go and sell those things when I finish and get my inventory all filled up and stuff. Good job, buddy. We make, an s we make a semi-okay team. I'm just going to continue over here and kill this thing. And then kill the next thing. One, two, three. Start killing. Yay, murder. Alright. I'm actually getting pretty close to a level up. <laughs> These pharaohs don't stand a chance against me, yo. Alright, they might stand a chance against me. I'm basically on the same level as them. Just a little bit stronger. Let's drink that. 
that and drink that. No, everything should be okay. Now I should just collect this gold real quick. Come on. Come on. Hmm. Uh, I know I mentioned that I was probably going to get a computer at Christmas this year. Um, and that's probably still going to happen, actually. I'm probably going to get a new laptop. And play games with people. Hey, Baba Boopy. Guess who just leveled up? This guy. Um, while in Utah, I'm probably not going to be able to record as many videos, but I'll still try, if that makes any sense. You know, because, like, I'll be busy with family and stuff, but I will certainly try to still pump out as many videos as I can. It's just going to be a little bit difficult, you know? <laughs> You can actually unequip all your armor and stuff. I want to see what it would look like between two people. Oh, that's that could be the next Ruckoy. Um, the next Ruckoy game, naked fighting. Nah, not a good name. And time to get out of there because if I had stayed around any longer, I probably would have died. And that guy dropped a lot of loot. Time to kill this pharaoh as well. Let's kill it. Kill it now. What? I didn't say anything. Why won't this thing just die? It's not going to win. I'm pretty sure it knows that. And if it doesn't know that, then it should know that because that's not going to win. Out of my way, maggots. Maggots. This is a bucket. No. <laughs> ah, soldier. You will never cease to be funny to me. Or to a lot of people in the TF2 community. I'm not a member of the TF2 community yet. Um, but when I get my computer, I'll probably get TF2. And, I don't know, probably play with a couple of you guys out there. You know who I'm talking about, if you're watching the video, that is. Hmm. Actually, that's a fair point. I don't know if he watches my videos, because I don't think I've ever actually seen him on any of my videos in my comment section. I do know that a couple of my IRL friends watch my videos, and I know that a lot of other people watch them, and not just my friends, because I have over 10 views uh, on a couple of my videos, so that's how I know that I have more than a couple of my friends watching my videos. Basically, if the pharaoh starts following me, I can start shooting it, no problem. Because magic is the same right has the same range as a monster's viewing distance. And also arrows, for that matter. It's strange. All um, ranged weapons, or all ranged attacks, except for the wizard's fireball, um, they are all confined to maybe one, two, three, four spaces away from you. Which isn't too terribly great if the enemy's faster than you. Because if the enemy's faster than you, just strip down to soldier. Like, that's the best advice I could give anyone in that situation. Speed. That's interesting. How much am I losing? I'm not even losing that much. This is just an all-around better armor to have, I don't know. And that's not even an armor, that's a hood. Oh yeah. The boy moves slightly faster now. 
to archers who pay attention to literally everything, this would be a big deal to them. But as a wizard who really doesn't give a crap, just literally just fireball and win. We have the most possible deaths per attack, per special attack, so there is that. And now it's my gold. Sorry, Psych Lee Ben. Not to leave. Oh, that's right. <laughs> I got I got one of my friends to play this game as well. Or another one of my friends to play this game as well. Huh, I totally forgot that I actually friended her in this game. I should get rid of her. I'm just kidding. Totally kidding. Uh this game is good, but it runs on a cardboard engine. No joke, it lags like literally no other game I've ever seen. <sighs> Eleven minutes already. Well, I can stop it now. Because I kind of want to get that added revenue snowball going. Totally kidding, by the way. That's not the only reason I make these videos. I make them just for fun because I don't make money off this yet. See, my dream job is act, well, dream job besides YouTube, I guess, would probably be chemist. Not sure what kind of chemist. Maybe a biochemist. I would like to make bioweapons. That'd be cool. You know, just go up to someone and say, hey, hey, I'm a biochemist. I make weapons. I'm a cool dude, McGee. I don't know what I'm talking about anymore. You guys know that I just senselessly ramble on in these videos, right? Because if you don't, then that's all I do. We don't want to talk about nothing else except for just nothing. <sighs> if you're talking about nothing, then nobody can say you're not. Then nobody can say you're being rude because you're not because uh, you're not saying anything, or at least anything of importance. Politics. I'm sorry. I know I shouldn't make political jokes, but... Never found anybody who really liked them, per se. I've always found people who are either just like, Ugh, politics? Or, eh, I can debate. Uh, seriously, nobody likes politics. And if you do like politics, then you're wrong. You're just pretending you like politics. Because nobody like pol because nobody likes politics. You might like debating, and that might be the reason why you're in politics, but nobody likes actual politics. Seriously, if there were any other candidates for president this year, they probably would have won. Because Hillary Clinton and Donald Trump are both terrible. But, Donald Trump is not as bad as Hillary Clinton, in my opinion. I'm still going to admit that he's a terrible, terrible person who deserves to be burned at the stake. But Hillary Clinton deserves much worse. Because, honestly... Sorry, can't go any further into politics or else I might get demonetized by YouTube. <laughs> well, it's going to be two years later when I'm actually getting a little bit bigger and YouTube will find this video, demonetize me, delete all my videos, and then I'll have to start over from scratch. Guarantee that's probably what will happen. Because YouTube demonetizes 
everyone they don't agree with. <sighs> Unfortunately. Oh. <laughs> Ads. <sighs> I swear it's almost as bad as YouTube. Sorry, but that's one thing I want to talk about. Like, if there are minute ads, sure, I wouldn't have a mind with them because they're skippable anyways. Because, like, after a certain point, they have to be skippable. After, if they're any longer than 30 seconds, they have to be skippable. But seriously, 30 second unskippable ads? That's just ridiculous. Like, 15 seconds m should be the minimum. Well, correction, should be the maximum for it to be an unskippable ad. For, well, it should be the minimum for it to be an unskippable ad. Like, if it's 15 seconds or shorter, I don't care. You can make it unskippable because it's just 10 more seconds. But if it's a 30-second unskippable ad for, like, a two-and-a-half-minute video, I don't want an ad to make a noticeable difference in the amount of time I'm viewing that one video. Because seriously, it's just ridiculous. We don't need those YouTube ads. Like, sure, if they're... Heck, I don't even care if it's like an hour-long YouTube ad. As long as it's skippable. Heck, I've seen five-second ads. Those are perfectly fine to be unskippable. I've seen ten-second ads. Less okay, but I won't really complain. Fifteen seconds? <laughs> Fine, whatever, I understand. You need, th you sometimes need a couple of extra seconds to s make your point so that nobody can skip it either. But ten, but thirty seconds? That's just, why? It just wastes everyone's time, it just wastes everyone's time. There is nothing, but there's nothing good that comes from it. It just wastes a bunch of time, and I usually click out of the video and then try rewatching it just so I don't have to watch the ad. Uh, anyways, that's this episode's rant over. Perhaps I should mention a couple of things about the enemies. Um, well, it's, it's probably become obvious up to this point, but I don't think I've ever mentioned that one enemy is a certain level and all of them are a certain strength, unless they're a boss. Which, in that case, is a very unique situation. But, there are sometimes these, as I like to call them, super bosses. There's one for each area, except for maybe the rats. Yeah, I don't think they have a rat king. But, let's see. In fact, the newest enemy, the slimes, even have their own super boss already. Uh, I th I'm pretty sure it's like the slime king. I think that's his name. Um, but for the pharaohs, I don't remember his name, but I actually fought against him. That guy was hard for my level 90 or so character. He put up one heck of a fight, and he al and my character almost died a couple times in that fight. I think they should make more of those, because those are fun to fight against. But these normal enemies are just... I don't know. Kind of a big waste of time, and also, sorry about that, my dad just texted me over Messenger. Not gonna make the same mistake I did last time. Um, but yeah. Well, I guess that's all I have to talk about for today. Um, if you guys have liked the video, then just, me just leave me a nice little comment down below. Um, and with that being said, I think I'd better just exit out here, so... Um, if you guys have liked my video, then just head down to the comments, leaving a nice little inspirational comment for the day. And with that being said, I will see all you guys next time. Bye-bye!